hey everybody it's gonna be your girl Miss Marie here and let's just go ahead and address the elephant in the room yes your girl is on these youtube streets with a bonnet on okay guys so anyways let's get straight into today's wig review install and all that jazz this right here is gonna be coming in from the janet collection okay guys boom boom so this right here is going to be their naturally curly line the premium synthetic fiber child i don't know what premium synthetic mean but it sounds good this right here is going to be in the style natural afro leon and i have this in the color orange aid okay guys again it's, excuse the reflective properties look guys okay because we always trying to shine bright like a diamond and all that jazz so yeah guys so um this seems to be a pretty easy and straightforward wig like it already comes with a bang and it's already like curly which are like literally some of my favorites so let's get straight into this wig review so boom now your girl loves herself like a little uh curly textured unit and so i said ciao and if you watch my vlog previously you guys already know that your girl went shopping at local pizza so it's child they was trying to sell this wig for like 30 plus bucks i said no thank you mm -mm. but i did see it and i viewed it and i like what my eyes saw so i just said girl just go ahead and buy this thing offline so your girl did purchase this from sans beauty with my own money so no this is not a responsive review your girl spent her own point. okay okay so let's get into this again guys freshly opened on camera okay it's literally has a little tabby right there so let's unhook that okay guys and again this is a full cap wig but let's get into this color this color is so beautiful and so bomb this right here is actually a special mix so it's like giving like a little like orange but not too much let me turn on my vanity light just so we can get a little bit more um sometimes i like to have my my brightness up higher so let's just do that right now okay y'all this right here is going to be the lighting a little brighter but this right here is cute i'm not getting any type of like weird funky smells from this guys um but let me look at these roots here child with me adjusting their light <laughs> feel like a little bit blinding um so this doesn't have dark roots but i'm loving this color okay guys you guys aren't new to this but true to this you guys know look it tell you everything hair may tangle in general but we all know synthetic wigs tangle and so do human hair wigs okay guys boom off this right here is going to be the cap construction again guys as i say this right here is going to be a full cap wig okay guys you guys know the drill okay two combs on left and right side then there should be one comb at the in the back and the bottom yes okay guys so now let's just see if this is a plop on and go wig let's just see time for the reveal boom yes wig cap ready you guys know it okay and i might be looking down at my vanity mirror which is right here <sighs> see now why i gonna play myself i knew i needed to adjust this wig to my big head let's just see <clears throat> child now this is not giving big hair friendly to me so this right here is going to be the wig straight out of the pack okay guys i don't know if i saved this but my hair is not as flat as it could be and so with me looking at my vanity let me actually turn this light on so lighting won't be changing momentarily come on now okay guys so let's get the vanity and the screen so for me i am seeing like a little bit of like browner roots and then it's coming out with uh, the orange like you know orange aid at the end um so i just want to make sure i have all the hair to the front okay and again guys i haven't done anything to this so yes i'm fully aware of the fact that the bangs aren't banging all that jazz so let me turn around for you guys so i'm gonna you know do 180 this way then a 180 the other way let me scoop back so there's gonna be the side the back of the wig then let's come on around here give you guys the side so if you guys are like me i love working with textured units such as this because literally all you gotta do is fluff it out with either like a you know afro pick as i like to call it with just a hair pick child or with your fingers but just try your best not to disturb the curl pattern and literally you just go in at it um this is given like a little bit like ice spice 
so but this right here is really going to be about getting this wig to our liking um if you guys didn't know i tend to prefer synthetic units for whenever i'm going out on vacation and stuff such as that um because child it's going to dry quick okay that's what it's going to do so again i'm just fluffing this out okay because of course this thing's been in the bag and i don't know for how long okay but i love myself some big curly hair so now let's focus on these bangs and let's see what it's really given okay guys and then with these type of units i try my best not to cut because i feel like over time if it already has a bang i feel like over time the hair is going to naturally like you know elongate and droop and all that jazz so it's really just going to arrive a fluffiness oh and i need to show you guys the top of this okay the reason why i like full cap wigs is because there literally shouldn't be like anything showing at the top okay should literally just be like you know hair that's what we should be giving hair no scalp okay that's what i love because it's right here it's going to be a true the one and go wig so i hope that came out you know on camera and again guys it's all about playing around so i'm seeing a couple pieces and it's like they're cool okay and then if you of course feel like there's too much hair of course you can cut and shape this to your liking but again guys um i'm personally not going to do this because I feel like this is honestly good the way it is. Okay. I know what you guys are thinking. Girl, hurry up and cut this piece right here. Yes, I am going to. Okay, guys, I am. Give me some time. I'm just trying to fluff it out. Okay? Because all hair matters, okay? You never know how these wigs are going to look. Or sometimes you may put your wig on. It may not be as centered as you hope. So at least the first couple of times me wearing this wig, I prefer not to do any type of, you know, too much manipulation as far as cutting. So I'm just going to cut the ones which are like, you know, right in the face. Or honestly, you could just, you know, scoot it to the side and hide it up in there. That's the perk of having, you know, a wig of this texture. So with this right here, I know you guys can see this piece. Again, guys, you can just go ahead, tuck this in there and i know what you're thinking okay girl you just pop this wig on your head so what do you do for security so for security purposes i would go in with a bobby pin to pin this down literally guys just go in bobby pin pin this down as i stated my hair is not as flat as i would like it to be so that will be something i would use i don't typically tend to use the combs anymore because i have noticed that when at least i use a combs child okay they put out a little bit of my hair so i do tend to be a bobby pin wearer or is it a bobby pinner bobby pinner I think I style like this. So with this piece right here is really getting on my nerves. So yes, your girl's gonna cut this. Okay, guys. Again, I'm gonna be looking down at my vanity. And again, it's better to undercut than to overcut. Okay. Better to undercut than overcut. Seeing your girl had a couple of these hairs just you know all up in there. So I'm gonna cut that. And then just really about just playing around with this and making this wig like your own, you know? I will say that with synthetic units, of course, they look better the more times you wear this. So I do expect for this wig to fully to get bigger, 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 bigger. And it's going to look gorgeous. Okay, guys. And again, you should fluff out the whole entire wig because it has been in a pack sealed up and all that jazz so stay tuned for the final look which shouldn't honestly deviate too much from what this bad boy is looking like because it is already giving okay it's giving so much it gave so stay tuned for the final results okay everybody so this right here is going to be the final result of the janet collection natural curly natural afro leon um style number again i have this in the colorway or shade orange shade and again guys this is giving cute and all I did was fluff her out and literally only cut two here to go guys a little, a little close up two pieces of hair and again all I did was basically child throw on some makeup and you know get cute for you guys but literally all you gotta do is fluff this out I don't know if I stated this but this wig right here was literally under 16 bucks as I stated earlier this wig would definitely be listed down below this right here is honestly just a throw one and go wig as I stated earlier guys um this wig is not big hair friendly when I you know went ahead and actually looked inside the wig i noticed that it was on its last latch so maybe if you uh are a you know bigger head to me child then you know 
maybe not use the little latches in there the little hook thing each out you guys know what i'm trying to say you know maybe just let it be free but again guys i do not believe that this wig is big hat friendly but it does definitely fit and the good thing about it is that because this does have natural bangs in it it's like you know like your wig cap can be a little bit you know to the front to the front let me actually see where my wig cap is at well actually um my wig cap is covered by the bangs but you really could just play around with this so i would maybe state or maybe a con would be, you know, this wig is not big hair friendly. A pro is that literally you can just throw this thing on and go. Now maybe not throw it on, you know, shake it a little bit, you know, shake it a little bit. So it can look like, you know, it's your hair, you know, it's grown, it's giving scalp, you know. But literally guys, I only cut two pieces of hair. So without me rambling on, literally this right here is a good throw on and go wig. Okay guys, this right here is going to be this side. And then of course, I'm going to give you guys 360. So let's get into it. But it is going to be a 180, then 180, okay. So it's just going to be the side. The back, again, I'm not sure how it's looking on camera, but you know, fluff this out to your liking. Okay, guys? I feel like sometimes people forget about fluffing out the back, okay? Like, that's how you can tell, you know, it's fresh out the pack, you know? This side. But again, guys, you cannot beat this. Again, this right here is gonna be the natural Afro Leon wig. And again, for under 17 bucks, you really can't beat this. I hope you guys enjoyed today's quick and easy wig tutorial slash wig review. Okay, uh, guys, um, I am going to be bringing forth more wigs on my channel. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Coming up next, we're gonna have another video of mine. So just go ahead and stay tuned and let that bad boy play on, play on. Okay, okay. <laughs>